Good morning. It is Wednesday, no it's not, it was Wednesday yesterday, it's Thursday morning here and um, I'm off to Ireland tomorrow so I'm really keen to um, show you something mm -hmm, mm -hmm. but uh, I'm not sure, I'm not sure what um, what clothes and I'm telling you I'll show you the limbs that you won't guess, you won't guess, oh no you won't no 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 you just will not guess so yes i really did so people have asked uh, it's either got four wheels or two legs it's got two legs um i really really would love that push chair um but i also not only would it not fit in my car i think if it fit in my car i would have got it but i actually have no room in hillside you've all seen hillside i have no room well, I do have room if I push, if I fold up all the other push chairs and all the other push chairs. But I like to keep things out on display. So, um, yeah, at the moment, the side by side double, the old side by side double takes up a lot of room in Hillside. Um, so I might fold that up. But I know in the summer I'll be wanting that out. When the, when it actually stops raining. We got rain again today. When it actually stops raining. <laughs> I will want that outside with the toddlers sat in it. Because they look so darn cute. Um, but I might fold it up. And put something else there in, in its place. That still doesn't mean I could fit. That's quite big. That push chair is quite big. And I like the push chairs. Because they're smaller and I can like fold them up and bring them out easier. And the Wayfarer prams, I like the carry pots on wheels prams as well. So, and I actually don't like really folding up my prams. <laughs> so there we go. Um, right, so yes. You would not have seen this one in my video of the doll show. Because I thought... That it was a baby using used to display clothing so I just glanced at it and was like cute but didn't think it was for sale um because uh, a lot of people when they sell their their wares they like to show you what they look like on the reborns and so they have a few reborns there for display and that's what I thought this one was so you wouldn't have even seen it on the video. <laughs> and um, and the reason that I'm saying you won't know what it is, because basically I don't know what it is. Um, it's a second hand reborn. It was in the lady's possession for many years. It's very cute. And... Um, I'll show you. Come and have a look. See what you think. I don't usually do blanket reveals like this way, but I'm going to, and there's going to be a reason for it. But um, let's just have a look at the light here because it is a very dull day, so the light is not good. This is probably the best area for light in the house. Um, so here's the leggies. Look at those little leggies. Oh, little cute the leggies. And little feet. I love the toes. Does anybody recognise the legs? And the re I'm actually proper asking for a reason. For a baby that was painted years ago, it's in amazing condition. And the vinyl is like Maisie. So when I had my Maisie kit, the vinyl was really soft. And the vinyl up until that point, I'd felt a lot of hard vinyl. The mottling is lovely. Um, I don't like it. They're very, it's very smooth, very soft. I don't like the texture that a lot of people put on their um on their babies. I don't like that feel, that texture. I like this smooth feel. So yeah, so 
full front loading legs. Okay, now let's do handy pandy poops. Because I don't know enough sculpts to even know whose hands these are, whose arms these are. I don't know if the legs match the arms. Totally in love with the vinyl. Just so reminds me of Maisie. It's so squidgy. So different from like Annie. Annie's era, the vinyl was quite hard. I think they pour it differently now when they redo the the Donna Rupert sculpts. When they, you know, do more additions, if you like, just re-pour it, don't they? But I think they use different vinyl now and it's lighter, but Annie's was very dark vinyl, very... I'm just trying to show you his little hand because it's really cute. Look at it. Little fingies. I just love it. Yeah, so, and I think it's probably the kit, the actual kit, it is probably the same era as um, the Maisie kit that I had. Definitely feels really soft, really, really nice. I like it. I like it a lot. And um, because it's only been used for display in um clothing it's been very well you know looked after kind of really right you want to get to the head so the reason i'm saying do you know what these limbs are is because the head and the limbs don't match <laughs> well they don't according to me looking them up anyway so i'll show you the back of the head first so you can see it is Judith by, is it Adri Stoetti? It's A.S. Judith. So it's Judith, and I don't know if I'm pronouncing that right. It's, um, I'm sure it's Adri Stoetti, Judith. So this is an old kit. Um, but when I look at the limbs, the limbs are different. <clears throat> For the kit. So that's why I'm asking if anybody can recognize the limbs. So this is a hybrid kit. So it's not a copy, it's a hybrid. It's a, an original, an original um, reborn, but a hybrid kit is what I believe it is. So if anybody could let me know what the um what the limbs are, what they think the limbs could be, that would be great. Because I know I got some reborn artists who watch. And get ready for the cutest face. Oh, cute little ear. Here, look. Here, look. Look at him. Look, the cutest. His hair is painted beautifully. I mean, she didn't even know who the artist was. She's had her that long. She thought she knew, but the lady doesn't reborn anymore. But um, she thought she knew, but, you know... There's no certificate, nothing, nothing came with him. And um, it was just, I was sat there talking to her and I was like, oh, he's lovely. I really like him. She said, he's for sale. I said, what? He's for sale? I was like, oh no, I love to have a cuddle. <laughs> and I had a cuddle. But look at the little button nose. I don't know if we can turn him around to the light this way. Let me see the light I mean you will get to see more of him from the light there so I was trying to think is it a girl's face or a boy's face and I haven't as you can see he's naked <laughs> I took off the outfit he came with and I'll show you that clip here I am just going to show you what he was wearing when I bought him. <laughs> this is what he was wearing. This is a brand new outfit. But um, this, yeah, it's too small for him. Look. It's like right stretched out. It's right down there on him. I had to push it right down there. But he's quite slim. He's quite slim, Jim. And you.
So I don't know. We might put a bit more stuffing in him. But um, I just wanted to show you. <laughs> hey, just wanted to show everybody how they do not how this lovely. It's a real pretty, cute little outfit though. Look at it. It's really, really cute. So I do. I love the outfit, but it might fit um, James better because it is newborn size. But so whereas the waist fits <laughs> the I mean, this the top fits him because it's a bit baggier. Trousers. Say, so they don't fit me, mommy. They just don't fit me. Look. <laughs> I like the buttons down the back, though. It makes dressing easier. But anyway, I'll show you a bit more detail of him. So that was the outfit he came with. And um, it was just... It's lovely. Um, but it was too small in the legs. He does have nice long legs. But, um, yeah, no, I love him. So his name is Eli. His name is Elijah. And I'm calling him Eli. He spent every night this week since Sunday in bed with me. By my, He's been by my side every day um, because I'm that taken with him. And when that happens, you know, that's good. <laughs> but I love him. He's so cute. Russ says he looks grumpy. And I'm like, no, he doesn't. He lives a new baby. And he's like... What is going on in this world? I don't know. <laughs> so I think he's going to take a cut down dummy. Um, but his skin is just, it does have mottling, but it's flawless, which is how my children were born. My children were born flawless. Not a lot of red or anything to them. So that's why I was asking, because um, it seems like it's a hybrid, unless she made another edition, but I couldn't find it on on Mr. Google. Unless she find, made another edition with these limbs. Um, there are a few artists that do um, change limbs in that because they don't feel that the first limbs work, or, or a customer might not like the limbs. I think the limbs were closed hands for this Judith kit. Closed fists. And uh, maybe the... Uh, maybe the um, didn't want didn't want him on there i don't know but anyway there he is so we're gonna get him dressed i've been dying to get him dressed <laughs> but i just wanted to do this video first let's move you back a bit so i get in there there we go let's do this a little bit now yeah but i wanted to um I wanted to video him, and, and I'm not sure what size he is, because he came in that newborn outfit, and it was too small, really, in my opinion. It didn't go up around the crutch area. This is a small nappy. It might do just for now. It's just one that I just found. As you know, I prefer using... Um, reusable simply because then you don't end up with loads of bags of nappies all over the place and this looks like it, it is going to be too small <laughs> just typical isn't it you got you got a big bum it's definitely definitely not newborn size are you that is that is yeah too small mate too small really that'll do for now so I did wonder if this might fit him. I bought this, gosh, ages and ages and ages ago from Next, and it was in the sale. And I don't know if you can remember me showing because it was such a good price. It was like two pounds or something like that. And I haven't used it on anybody. And it was right back when I had Alistair, I think. And um, so I haven't used it on anybody. So I thought I might try this on him. I do have a lot of 0 to 3 that I kept back from where I had Mr. Henry. So we do have 0 to 3 as well. Um, who had this? Oh, this was this was that silicon boy who had this. That might fit you, mate. That says up to three months. 
this is up to three months. I think this is what Henry had on. So he might be able to get away with some of this. That looks like it might be a bit big. I like the Gruffalo set. Hmm. I think they might be a bit too big. He might be just, but this is quite big for up to three, up to one month. But let's see what he looks like. Give him his first posh clothes. I don't have a vest. I'll find a vest that fits him. I don't have many vests, to be honest, in this size. So what I could do with doing is getting some white vests. This is fancy schmancy, mate, this one. There we go. Where have we come? There. So I don't really know what it is about him, but he said he actually, the feeling I get with him is the feeling I have with I have Alistair. And um, so I know I like him a lot. And I have sold quite a few babies, haven't I, recent months, so. I need to, add, oh, I don't know, see that is, that ju this just fits him as well. He's got long legs, you've got long legs, mate. Yeah, you do, you have long legs. Oh, that's so cute, I do have a big neck, crikey. This is just, 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 just fitting him. <laughs> it looks so cute. I'll bring you down in a minute to have a look. Look at you, little handsome fella. Oh, you're so handsome. You're so handsome in that. Thank you, do. Wow, mummy's little cherub. Thank you. The legs, yeah, they literally does just about fit him. Hang on. Okay, cool, it's got really dark because <laughs> can't see very far. But look at it. Look. It literally is just fitting him. So I think some of my smaller 0 to 3 will fit him. It is tight around his. The baby grow part is actually quite tight around here. But it looks cute, doesn't it? You look very dapper in that, mate. That's the first thing you've had on. <laughs> Isn't it? You've been a naked baby since Sunday night. Or Monday. Monday, maybe. <laughs> so bloody cute. You are. You're so cute. He is in my old car seat here that we had with Auntie Sarah that actually does a rocking motion. Isn't that great? Don't need like tons of stuff. Years, even years ago, they thought about you not needing tons of stuff in your house. This is like a rocking one as well. Although I do have to say, Rebecca doesn't like how deep that the car seats are, the older ones. Like when we had um, my grandson in here and he was tiny, she didn't like how low down they went, how far back they went. But um, he is, anyway, I can't remember how to put this down. Oh, I think it's up here. Push down, that's it. There we go. I can never remember because they're all so different. I put the head hugger in there, like Mr. Henry doesn't need the head hugger in here, does he, when he sleeps in here? I think he'll look lovely in the Wayfarer as well. Yeah, there he is. There he is. He's so flipping cute. He's so cute. Ain't you, mate? Okay, if you're going to stay in there now for a bit. Because that was a bit of a kerfuffle, wasn't it? I'm changing you and that. You can have a rest now. That's a lot for a baby, isn't it, to get changed? Okay. Yeah, it is. You'd like a nice little rest and a little rock. Whoa, that was a bit fast, Mummy. See, that's a bit fast. 
Oh, he's so cute. You see his little face. Yeah, look at his face. He's so cute. <laughs> well, thank you very much for watching our new adventure with this. No, none of that came out right. <laughs> thank you very much for watching us with our newest addition. Not new adventure. Although he will be going on new adventures. <laughs> but with our new addition, thank you very much for watching. Anyway, we'll see you in the next video. Bye, friends. <laughs> Also, don't forget to let me know if you recognise the hands and the legs. Maybe they are completely different, two different limbs as well, two different sets of limbs. Who knows? But whatever, I love him. He's gorgeous. He's so flipping cute and he definitely is a boy sculpt, boy reborn. Do you think that? I did see girl in him a few times, but driving home, um, he just kept telling me his name was Eli. Elijah and so there we go and I think I put it up on Instagram ha 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 um I think I put Dylan and Eli up on Instagram as names to choose and reborn boy or girl and stuff like that to kind of give you a bit of a tease <laughs> oh, sorry to those of you who don't like teasing because I don't like teasing myself but this is all in play this is not Passive aggressive teasing. <laughs> this is just play. Anyway, thank you again very much for watching. We'll see you in the next video. Bye. Bam.